Hello everybody and welcome back to Tales from the Borderlands. I'm your host Little Purple Spider. We will be continuing where we left off. Oh. I've been looking forward to replaying this game again. It has really taken a spot in my heart. Here we go. I will name my firstborn Loderbot. <coughs> so, buddy? Oh, you know, pr probably not. But. <laughs> I, I can't believe we're alive. I mean, I, I never want to see somebody's brains come out of their nose. Not ever again. That, that was the single scariest experience of, of my entire life Ew. which should probably be over by now but it's not for some reason but for those guys a lot of those guys it's over now we made it i mean his brains just just like like snot yes Ew. okay that was awful i agree but we got through it you know and that probably shouldn't have happened at least now we know we can handle ourselves. If, if what? If brains ooze out of people's noses? <laughs> well, yeah, basically. I guess you sort of have a point somewhere in there. All right, let's just find yes. this guy, August. Buy the key. Oh, blue mom. Get the hell out of here. I can quite stand there. Powerful skag diet, literally anything. Habitat, wherever it wants. Sweet points, good luck. The existence of an alpha skag indicates that there is a certain hierarchy in skag social structure. One in which the biggest jerks apparently boss everyone else around. Ugh. I hate these. Likes its territory, dislikes things on its territory. Spider ants are burrowing insects, commonly found in areas of open ground which will attack anything that shrugs on their territory. Also, many of them are racist and hate the, that restaurant that you love. <laughs> We've got Bully Mong there. <coughs> Bully Mong killed in the frozen waste. Intelligence low, speed fast enough, strength effing high. Twice the arms for twice the fun. They're the pet for everyone. Bully Mong Jingle by Horace Smith Marketing Exotic Pet. No thank you, I will not have one of those. It's just a texture. Okay, let's go. That has bark. Gaius, throat, wood thirsty, dispoon. This position, positive attitude, hunting Boris is best be <laughs> best avoided by small children, the elderly and anyone with a heartbeat. Seriously, just run they're not even tasting. So I believe the flesh slayer. Alpha. So that certain rituals involve coloured barrels can raise sparkle from it. Aquatic somber to perform elaborate dance routines. That's the words, what are you gonna do, stab me? Oh! 
not to be confused with his brother Boom, was the first mate of Captain Flint. As his name subtly implies, Boom enjoyed hurling caustic explosives and making things blow up by any means necessary. Who around hmm. here doesn't? Pandoran resident and fine dining oh. connoisseur, Shade, was held in high esteem by his fellow neighbors in Oasis. Not in the least bit insane, he will be missed. I am really not into this at all. <laughs> Relics. <laughs> oh, I remember this guy. He was an asshole. Formerly a scientific researcher who worked for Hyperion, Professor Nakayama was obsessed with cloning Handsome Jack, who he carried a certain fondness for. Killed by stairs! <laughs> no witty rejoinder? You must be more traumatized than I am. Hey, you still got his Hyperion ID chip. Really? Keep it. Hyperion pays out a nice bonus for recovering those things. O oops. Um, hold on. <laughs> the once ruthless leader of the Crimson Lance, Commandant Steel. Her leaderness came to an end when she was skewered by a monstrous tentacle. Ooh. She later died a second time after having been resurrected as some kind of cyborg zombie thing. <laughs> Can we just get on with this? No, I'm looking. Are you serious? Well, this feels like we came in the back, so maybe there's a front door somewhere? Yeah, I don't know if we can get out there with the murderers all over the place. Maybe one of those bodies has a key or something and we just missed it. Well, I mean, if we just randomly found the key, I mean, that would be amazing. I looked at it. Oh god, he's alive still. <laughs> How are you? Not great! Are you two not just the handsomest devils I've seen in ages? <laughs> Why are you pretending to be dead? What? <laughs> dead? No, 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 no. Asleep, baby. Dead. That's your. You're getting ahead of yourself. <laughs> what? 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 What is this? Is this part of the like some kind of ride or something? Since the moment we walked in, it's just been one big freaky puppet show. So I. Thanks. <laughs> I'm Shade. And this is my world of curiosity. Let me tell you right off the very bat, I am deeply sorry that you strapping young threshers of gentlemen here have to witness it in such sad disrepair. 
Time can take a toll, you know. And on more things than one. <laughs> but unfortunately, we are closed for renovations. But that doesn't mean you have to leave, of course. No. <laughs> I mean, we can do other things. Listen, we're to make a deal, all right? We're buying a thing. Something valuable? You know anything about that? I know a lot of things about a lot of things, and this thing in particular. <laughs> You're Hyperion, right? Here for August. Yes. Yeah? If you want to buy something strange and illegal, <laughs> this is certainly the place to do it. Creepy. My grandpappy. He's the one who came up. He was a real thinker, you know, a real lover of animals. <laughs> Still is, actually, because he's definitely not dead. But the place itself. What happened? You get stuck in traffic? You Hyperion guys, you're usually so punctual. Yeah, <laughs> well, sorry we're late. Getting here was a little more complicated than we thought it'd be. Yeah, well. That's Pandora for you. If it ain't a friggin' bug stampede, some jerk-off is using you for rocket practice. All right, well, <laughs> I'll just leave you to your business things then. I'm August, but I figure you know that already. Is, uh, is Vasquez coming? Vasquez? <laughs> he was just the go-between, the middleman. The puppet, the pigeon. Stop. I'm the one who's buying the key. Yeah? Well, I guess as long as you got the money, one Hyperion bootlicker's as good as another. So, what's your name? Just so we're on uh, equal footing. It's Reese. Reese? <sighs> Reese. Isn't that what I said? Sure. Just sit down and let's do this so we can move on with our lives. Okay, so, let's see the money. Cash only for this deal. And I hope you brought big bills. Uh-uh, no. I know how this works. We see the merchandise first, then you see the money. Yeah. <sighs> all right, all right. The baby wants its bottle. <laughs> Fine. I mean, I'll just show his bills. Oh, wow. Ever okay. see anything so pretty in your miserable lives? This thing will practically dance at your wedding. State of the art alien crap. It's. Eh. I mean, don't get me wrong, for a vault key, it's fine, but you gotta remember, we're from Hyperion. Okay, so. Sure. Okay. Okay, so. The way I uh, usually do these things is. Wait! What? I. Oh, I just don't like it. I gotta. I got a feeling. What feeling? Look, you said when I started to get a feeling about something that I should tell you and that we should walk away, right? What are you possibly feeling right now? We're almost done. Is she okay? Yeah, yeah, she's just freaking out. She does that sometimes. Sasha, what the hell are you... I just... I just don't like it. They've had this dumb attitude on their dumb faces since the moment they walked in. What are you talking about? And why, why wouldn't they show you the money, huh? What's uh -oh. up with that? Sasha? They've been all, oh, yes, sir, and oh, no, sir, and oh, I have the money we agreed upon right here. Nothing you're saying is bad. Nobody does that. And especially Hyperion or monkeys who'd rather bomb a small village than talk things through. I mean, look at that guy. Look at his face. Hey, Sasha. Sasha, listen to me. I, I'm asking you to please trust me on this one. I know you don't trust Hyperion. Yeah, you think? And I know you have zero reason to trust us, but I'm telling you, you're not like those assholes. In, in fact, we're trying to get back at one of the worst assholes up there, and we need that key to do it. So please, take the money and let us screw over one of the biggest jerks on Hyperion. 
please. So you're saying this key will get used to screw over some wretched Hyperion stooge? That's exactly what we're saying. All right, I'm sold. <laughs> awesome, let's do this. Well, just wait, just wait. Uh, August, everything's fine now. I mean, I don't know. If you really think... No, no, it's okay. The feeling's gone, August. Let's do the deal. I don't know. Maybe today's not right oh. for this. If, if, if things are weird... Uh, the bad feeling is gone, August. She said so herself. We still got a deal here. There's no problem. Let's just... No, I'm, I'm sorry, guys. I was... I thought I was gonna deal with Vazquez, and now this, I just... I just think we should call it off until I... I think things are square. Maybe another time, fellas. Hun, we're here. We should just do this. Really. No, okay. I made up my mind. August, wait! Priest, this is your department. Do something! Mm -hmm. It's okay. You don't know it yet. Know what? Uh, this... This is it. You can't see that one day, maybe ten years from now, maybe ten months, maybe tomorrow, you're gonna think back on right now and scream to the stars for mercy of death just so you'll not have to live in the wondering of what could have been. What if I had seen? chance by the throat what if i had beaten my fears taken what was so rightfully mine what if i had won <laughs> i am a winner i am a winner <laughs> <laughs> oh my god <laughs> inspirational speeches Yay. What a 